carmine on the West Kettle River, in the pine woods, on the Okanagan Highlands. Old Carmine, you came to our rescue, me and my darling, when we needed a home. In 1896, a man named James Dale had a mine not a hundred yards from where this old house still stands. He named it the Carmine Mine after his hometown of Carmine, Illinois, and this little town grew up around that mine. Old Carmine, on the West Kettle River, in the pine woods, on the Okanagan Highlands. Old Carmine, you came to our rescue. Me and my darling, when we needed a home. James Dale himself was even at one time postmaster of this little town. And what is now our house was uh, once the postal outlet and also a general store. Old Carmine on the West Kettle River in the pine woods, on the Okanagan Highlands. Old Carmine, you came to our rescue, me and my darling, when we needed a home. In October, I think, of 1906, James Dale's nephew, also named James Dale, shot a couple of guys after an argument over dinner at the boarding house. He was tried in Greenwood, found guilty, taken to Kamloops and hanged. Old Carmine, on the West Kettle River, in the pine woods, on the Okanagan Highlands. Old Carmine, you came to our rescue, me and my darling, when we needed a home. The fact that our street, Dale Avenue, was named after James Dale, the mining man, postmaster would seem pretty much self-evident. I wonder what that argument was about. Old Carmine on the West Kettle River in the pine woods on the Okanagan Highlands. Old Carmine came to our rescue me and my darling when we needed a home. Says, You're an old Carmine Albon.